Hello? Hello? Yes? Who is this? Mm, who are you trying to reach? What number is this? What number are you trying to reach? I don't know. Well, I think you have the wrong number. Do I? It happens. Take it easy. Hello? Oh, sorry, I dialed the wrong number. Well, so why'd you dial it again? No, no, this is a different person. I just wanted to say I hated you in E.T. and Charlie's Angels sucked. You're forgiven. Bye now. Hey, wait, don't hang up. What? I clogged the toilet and I don't know what to do. They've got 900 numbers for that. See ya. It's because there's no way a girl could have killed him. That is so sexist. The killer could easily be female. Basic instinct. That was an ice pick. Not exactly the same thing. Yeah, Casey and Steve were completely hollowed out. How do you gut someone? I mean, it's it's pretty easy. You just you just take out their insides and and put it in little jars. You know, put it in the fridge. You're all set. Are the police aware that you dated the victim? What are you saying? That, that I killed her? It was me. I did it. It was me. It would certainly improve your high school kill. I did it. it was me. I didn't kill anybody. No, nope, wasn't that creepy guy over there. It, it was me. Nobody said you did. I, I confess. <laughs> I did it. Don't go on with the rest. Thanks, buddy. What? What should I do about my son? He's, he's trying to kill everyone. Go to the town of Megiddo in the old city of Jezreel. Where's that? Can I get some kind of reference? Is there a McDonald's near that or something? There, see the old man, Bugenhagen. What? Bugenhagen. Bugenhagen? Bugenhagen. Bugenhagen? Bugenhagen. Bugenhagen? Bugenhagen. 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 Ali? Hello? If you so much as lay a finger on them, I'll kill you! You hear me? I'll kill you! <laughs> Man, are, are you okay? My wife, she, uh, she mentioned your name. She did? What, what'd she say? I mean, was she happy? Did she say good things about me? She told me not to believe you. Oh man, I thought you knew. I mean, me and her, yeah, we, we've been hitting it off. It's been great. She told me you knew me. Of course I know you. I mean, we've, we've been stuck in this, in this Restroom for how long? A day? Who are you? I'm spicy. Stop the lies! You're a liar! Okay, you got me. You got me. I'm RJ. I mean, gosh, I, I hear you watch my show. Why, why do you watch my show? Because it's the truth. Yeah? Well, I have pictures of you eating at McDonald's. McDonald's. It's a good place, huh? Oh, the traveler has come. Choose and carry. What do you mean, choose? We don't understand. Oh, I get it. I get it. Oh, very cute. Whatever we think of. If we think of J. Edgar Hoover, J. Edgar Hoover will appear and destroy us, okay? So empty your head. Empty your head. Don't think of anything. We've only got one shot at this. The choice is made. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did you choose anything? No. Did you? My mind is totally blank. I didn't choose anything. It just popped in there. What? What just popped in there? I... I... I tried to think. Try to think of the most harmless thing. Something I loved from my childhood. 
Something that could never, ever possibly destroy us. That's Reggie Ford from Time Well Spent.